Hey guys, what's going on? So we are in Ohio now. Right now on uh, about the junction with 313. Got to make it right onto this. Just following navigation right now. A lot of beautiful roads out here, it looks like. But uh, yeah, so I'm trying to find a supermarket nearby the campsite. So just need to pick something up real quick and then get to the campsite. That way I can set up and relax. <laughs> I want to relax, dude. I think I did like 520 miles today. I can't look because these turns, it's like a lot of rolling hills and well, I can look right now. Uh, 519 so far and it's 15 more miles so you know almost almost there almost about five almost 530 a little more than that uh yeah so I need to find a supermarket because I pre-cooked my rice I pre-cooked some eggs for breakfast and I got them in a the cooler in the back I'll show you that later I am uh, I just want to get uh, maybe a, a, a little piece of steak or something and I'll cook that in a pot I got a little season and I'll throw that on and cook that on the pot while I'm uh, while I'm setting up the tent and I can go on and do whatever else I just wanted to record a little bit just to let you guys see this see some of this oh my god look at this this is so beautiful dude dude gotta get a picture gotta get a picture bro one second I don't mean to talk like that this almost like I'm talking to my daughter who is a clown also but anyway that's besides the point wow beautiful just just amazing right yeah anyway uh, this is I want to say first time in Ohio on a motorcycle last time I've ever been to Ohio I was a young young very very, very young kid and uh, it was probably up further north oh, further north of here I forgot the name of the town but um it was further north and I don't remember anything about it so yeah all right let's take off anyway yeah these roads through here are just amazing um just kind of just cruising through them right now just making my way to the campsite and then from there i need to i just need to find a better place to, uh, a place where i can get a little slab of meat so just gotta see what i can find of being careful on these farm roads this one thing i learned from vermont farm roads tend to be uh, a little dirty you can have a little bit of gravel <laughs> i learned that on the back roads of kentucky too yeah that was a fun lesson very fun lesson um yeah guys i'm, I'm freaking stoked man I'm, I'm seriously stoked to be here awesome so awesome and still getting a little a little bit of uh twistiness in what <laughs> ow awesome sauce bro awesome sauce yeah so as i get closer i just need to figure out where the supermarket is and i kind of don't want to look at this see gravel through here yeah i kind of don't want to um get too close right i'm 14 miles away i don't want to get too close and then um all right you know what i'm gonna do since i'm 14 miles away let me let me navigate to the Kroger because all I got to do is just go there, pick the stuff up, and and then 
just make my way to where I'm going. 7.3 miles. Then I can go to camp, I can set up, get busy. This, and the rear jug can stop roasting my nutsack. Sometimes I have to definitely have to look at these roads before I make these rights because I don't know man. Some of these roads GPS be trying to tell you to go down. You gotta be careful. Where where where's this thing got us going, huh? Where? Where are we going? I'll turn off the back camera. Where are we going? Oh, we're going to make a right here. Okay. Yeah, guys. So overall, the ride was uh, pretty good. Nobody coming. The ride was pretty good. Uh, couldn't complain. Oh. <sighs> There's only one point that I kind of felt a little extra tired, but um, other than that, I think I was all right. Jesus. And I slowed down on that corner because I saw grass. This guy comes flying around it. Yeah, so there was one point where I was kind of a little bit overly tired, and I was like, you know what? Uh, and that's when my... my uh, uh, that thing came loose and you know I pulled over I was like you know what let me just pull over I saw she just pulled over and, and tightened it up used the bathroom um, bought a small coffee and after that dude I, I felt all right man I was I was uh, pretty good look at this man. Oh, oh, oh. oh it's beautiful Wow Beautiful man. Look at that, dude. What is this called? Rick's Mills Road. Wow. It's that beautiful man. Oof. Man. We just cruising out here like we don't gotta go buy some gas or nothing. No, we don't gotta buy no gas. No, we just cruising. Right? <laughs> yep. Oh wow. butterfly didn't die or anything I'd have felt bad about that oh my god it is beautiful out here wow I mean I know Kentucky is beautiful bro but wow this is this is really this is really awesome and imagine this is their view like they wake up in the morning and go outside and or just look out the window and look at that that's what they see you wake up in the morning and that's what you see in the morning right jeez louise can you beat that or no i don't know so imagine you buy a house out here you're getting like 20 how many acres <laughs> you know what i mean jeez louise oh very beautiful These turns are great for my tires because I've been sitting on a highway for the last 500 miles. But that's, I, got, I got the Commander 2 in the back and the Commander 3 up front, so they're all right actually. They can, they're kind of made for that stuff. They have that harder center core, softer outer edges, so you know they're kind of made for that. Butterflies just flying everywhere. Yeah.
susah dude That's pretty cool right? <laughs> he like looked, she or she looked up was like hmm. I'm like hmm. <laughs> Oh man be out in these these roads when it's dark that's why I left early heck no shoot suckers joke out here it's pitch black I can tell you that right now well it's probably be coming out the woodworks too far 0.4 miles away
guys, I see a gas station we're gonna fill up and 